Railways are part of our modern life, but there is a massive historical connection. A connection that brings back a bygone era and a modern world of speed and power. So, why is it that people are so fascinated by the railways today? Here is Nathaniel Parker, a railway photographer, speaking about his railway life. My earliest memory of the railways was at the Great Central. It was on the end of Fluffborough platform and we'd just been for a ride up to Leicester North and back and it was behind the WD class which lives at North Norfolk Railway and that's 9775 and yeah it's just stuff like that that gives me my earliest memories. In the railway community I'm a part of a group that looks after locomotives which is actually on my shirt 5305 Locomotive Association I'm a part of the Great Central Railway and I'm looking hopefully to become a member of the North Norfolk Railway. I have a job on the railway as well as doing the railway as my hobby. In the railway world as a job I'm at Etches Park and I clean all the trains at night and that consists of cleaning all your modern trains that you ride on around the network so they'll go to London St Pancras, they'll go to Sheffield, Loughborough, Derby and you take a bit of a pride in the job you do when you're cleaning that kind of thing. The thing that attracts me to the railways is people and as well the locomotives so with people you meet people from all different walks of life and they can show you all different things but as well it's having that accessibility to the community I could say in the railways because instead of like most lads my age could be just sat behind a screen playing games but the thing I like with this community is you get out you do stuff and you're not just inside I like being out I like being involved with railways I like doing something, doing something that's contributing, but as well making a difference. What got me into photography really was my grand had a little handheld camera, and he bought, he just bought this DSLR, and I said to him, "Well, can I not have a camera?" And he says, "Ah, I've got a camera for you." After a couple of months, we found some photos, and we found this local camera competition. And I entered in it. I came up second place and it was a photo of Oliver Cromwell just coming off shed because she'd just come out of her overhaul at that point. One of the nicest roads to take photographs on I would say is the North Yorkshire Moors and the Seven Valley Railway because they're very picturesque. My favourite railway photograph has got to be of Oliver Cromwell sat at Loughborough Station. It was a very cold night but it was very atmospheric down at Loughborough Station. I was the only photographer there. And I was taking all these pictures and everything and I did a long exposure one and I thought it won't work properly and I did it and it actually came out really nice and it's been used on the internet. But with my photography I do post it on social media, I have a page on Flickr, Facebook and as well I have a YouTube channel and I post on Instagram as well and I have a website which is promoting my photography. <laughs> 